welcome back to my channel. I'm Daniela, your independent Sensi consultant, and today I have Melting Monday. If you don't know, Melting Monday is where I share everything that I have warmed from Sat Friday, Saturday through Friday, um, Saturday through Friday. I also rate my bars, so a one is no thank you, not for me. None of these are ones because I've warmed them. A two is I'll warm it and see. Um, sometimes those are also like, I will use up what I have, but I don't really like it. A number three is I like it, I'd use it. If it was on clearance, I would probably repurchase. A four is I really love it, I would repurchase it full price. And A five is it is in my club, will be in my club, some variation of that. So um, there's a lot this week and I think I'm missing a couple of bars from what I warmed to my classroom. So I'm gonna try to remember what I warmed to my classroom. Um, but it's been, it's been a week. It was back to school night and, um, just a lot going on. So, um, I also wasn't feeling great. So it was just been like a lot of stuff going on. So it was also a short week and it was our first week of full day. So that was kind of crazy. Um, if you don't know, I'm a teacher. I always forget to say that cause I feel like I already have said it a lot. Um, but if you're new to my channel, I'm a teacher. I teach kindergarten. Um, and the first few weeks of school, we actually get out early at like 12 and now we are going to our full day, which is 210. So it's a lot for the kids. It's a lot for me. There's a lot of things that are going on that we're trying to like work out. Like we have PE now with a PE teacher and just trying to get all those schedules, um, worked out. And then it was also back to school night on Wednesday. So, um, was real tired like run down just from from it being such a crazy week but um I'm feeling better so that's awesome and yeah I'm gonna try to remember what I warmed to my classroom but I I don't I I uh, it's bothering me because I know I know I warmed something and it was something good but I can't for the life of me remember what it was I know it wasn't watermelon tangerine because I warmed that before meet the teacher and I warmed something different this time. Um, but I can't remember. So there's that. I don't know. I think it's in my bag too, but I don't want to go get it. So anyways, we're just going to get started. So the first thing is Disney Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas. Jack's Obsession. And this was warming in the dining room. And it is one of my favorite apple scents. I love this one. It's scent notes are apples, apple spiced with clove and cinnamon. It's a good one. Love it. It's a, I believe it's a five. I think it's in my club. If it's not in my club. It has been so I may have taken it out because I have a lot of them but I don't know um next up is strawberry lemon cake and this was in the media room this is another good one I don't know if this is in my club or not I cannot remember which is great because my club video is going to come out in a week and so if I tell you all the things I have in my club then that ruins that um it is where are the scent notes? I can never find anything. Strawberry lemon cake. Uh, fresh strawberries, lemon zest, and vanilla buttercream. I love this one. It's so good. It is a five. If it's not my club, then it's a four. But really, I love it. So it should be a five. I don't know. <laughs> Next is Squeeze the Day. This is a classic. Everybody has pretty much smelled this one. Um... It's not my favorite lemon scent. I will say that. Um, it is squeeze the day. Lemons and vanilla cream. I prefer lemon sorbet or lemon lime fizz is my favorite lemon scent, but I will use this. I don't know that I would repurchase it to be honest. If there was no other lemon scent, then I would. But it's just not my favorite lemon scent. I know it's like a classic staple and everything, but it's just not my favorite lemon scent. So um it's like a three, maybe a four for me. Like, I like it. It's fine. It's just not my favorite. So. 
and that was in the kitchen. Next is sea salt mist, and this was in the bathroom, and this is driftwood beach grass, beach grass, or oh my gosh, driftwood beach grass orange. <laughs> Why do I keep saying orange? Driftwood beach grass ocean mist. <laughs> Sea salt, mandarin, and amber. There's a lot of things in this. I actually like this one. It was pretty good. I'd say it's between a three and a four for me. It's nothing like super special, but it is a nice bathroom scent. So, next up is caramel praline cake, and this was in the living room. This is one of my favorites. I really like this one, um, but it is probably at four. I don't think it's in my club. I don't even know. No, it's not in my club. I don't think. Anyways, um, if I can find the notes. Do do do. Caramel praline cake is sweet praline, buttery vanilla, and caramel drizzle. It's so good though. It's like that like nice bakery goodness. Next up is a frightfully Disney's frightfully dis delightful. Um I just talked about this in the Harvest collection that I uploaded yesterday, which is really today. Today is Sunday, which is why I'm wearing football stuff. Um, it is not my favorite, but I did like it this time. So I don't know because sometimes like wax does better when it's been sitting for a little while. Um, it is called curing, I guess, and it gets better. So I'm wondering if because I had this bar last year i bought this bar last year and i used part of it last year and then i didn't use it again until this week um so that it's been sitting for like a, a year it's better or what um it is i can't find it where is it mm -hmm. there it is Golden Pumpkin, Bright Harvest Peach, Whipped Vanilla and Brown Sugar. It's still probably a three for me, I think. I would purchase it on clearance. It's just not my favorite, um, but it was fine. And that was in my bedroom. And then, okay, Spiced and Spirited. <laughs> so this was in the media room and I do not love this. It's a good scent, like when I open the bar and I smell it, it smells good. I like the scent. However, it is a headache inducing scent in my opinion. Um, I don't get headaches from scents and I didn't get a headache from this, but I can see how it's overpowering and could give people headaches. Um, where is it? Spiced and Spirited is pumpkin, brown sugar, and bourbon. I really liked the bourbon in this. It's just so strong. I think I think that's what it is. I'm not really sure. It was just so overpowering. Like it's it's okay, but I think I just can't warm it for a long period of time. So I had this warming for like 24 hours and then I changed it out. Um, I would probably only wear, warm it for like five hours. It's just not my favorite. So it's probably like a three. Next up is Autumn Road Trip. I have no idea where I warmed this. Let me think. Where did I warm this? Let's see all the other things that help sometimes. Um, I think this might have been in my bedroom. No, this is in the half bath. Autumn Road Trip was in the half bath. And sorry, that took me way too long to figure out. Right? Yeah, that's right. Um, Autumn Road Trip is Harvest Apple, Anjou Pear, and Silver Oak. Again, I didn't like this last year, but I liked it more this year. So it's still probably like a three or four for me. It's in between, but um, it was better than I. I used to think it was, so there's that. 
Um, next up is Cashmere Leaves. And this was, I think, part of the Harvest Collection last year. Um, it's Falling Leaves Crisp Apple and Cashmere Spice. Yeah, it was part of last year's Harvest Collection. Again, another one that I didn't love last year and I actually really liked it this year. So this was in the living room. I did switch out most of my warmers um, twice, most, not all. Um, so that one's probably like three or four for me. Um, next one is Breakfast in Bed and this is one of my favorites. This is a five for me. It's not in my club because it can't be, but I got it on like a flash sale. Um, and I really love it. If I could put it in my club, I think I would. It is warm pumpkin pastry, black raspberry, and sweet cinnamon drizzle. It's so good. It is so good. That was in the media room. Um, that's what I switched out the spiced bourbon or what's it called? Spiced and spirited for. And then, um, I put Jack's Obsession in a few days later. So next up is Evening Sky. It doesn't want to focus. There we go. And this was in the dining room. It is Soft Bergamot, Rich Madagascar Vanilla, and Midnight Lily. I really like this one. It's four for me. It's just like, like, it's like that soft, musky scent where it's it's leans a tiny bit floral, but not overbearing floral. Like, I don't really like floral, so you get that little woodsiness to it, um, which I like, but it's not like trees. So, I really like this one. It's a four for me. Next up is Sips of Cider. And this one was in the half bath, I believe. And this is Blood Orange, Sparkling Ginger, and Cinnamon Stick. I like this one also. It's probably between a three and a four for me. Um, I like it on warm, so it's probably closer to a four. I'd probably repurchase this. It smells really good. Um, it's got that little bit of spice to it, which I like for the holidays. But it is still that citrusy scent. Um, and that was in the half bath. And then the last one is Scentsy Sunshine, which this is from SFR, so you actually can't purchase this. Um, and I don't know if I have scent notes for it. Oh, I do. Lemon, yuzu, and sparkling sugar. This one, I wish I could put in my club or at least buy more of. It's a four, maybe a five for me. Um, I just really like this one. I don't know what it is about it. We got dice, like foam dice that are kind of like, um, they're scented. So it's kind of like the, like the little spiders. If you're familiar with the spiders or like the stitch, um, little ball, that's like a head, a stitch head or an angel head. Um, it's like that where it's like squishy, but it's scented and they were in the spirit box that we got for SFR and my shirt was in there and it just like the whole thing smelled so good. Um, so it was from this scent and it's so good and I really love that scent. So, um, and then in my, in my, what's it called? I don't know what I had in my classroom. I, I think it was Tangerine Creamsicle. I feel like it was tangerine creamsicle, but I could be totally wrong on that. What did I put in there? I'm gonna say it was tangerine creamsicle because I can't imagine what else I put in there. So it's ice tangerine, icy tangerine mango and vanilla cream swirl, which is in my club. It's a five, it's one of my favorites. I'm pretty sure that's what was warming in my classroom. And if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure that's what it was. Um, so yeah, that is all I have for you for Melting Monday, right? Yeah, that's empty. Um, football season started, so let me know if you watch football or you have a team. Let me know down below what your team is. I'm a Commanders fan. Don't ask me why. It's a long story. Um, even though I live in Northern California and I should be a Niner fan, I'm not because 
I had to be different from my family. So anyways, um, yeah. And you don't need to tell me that my team is terrible. I know. Thank you. Okay. Let me know down below what team do you root for if you do watch football. And yeah, that's all I have. So thanks, like, comment, subscribe, all the things. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.